I just found out something about Tina that that I need to talk to her about, and I don't know what to do. It's so weird. It's so weird, you guys. Okay, so you guys might remember a couple of months ago we did a video, and I was super excited. It was back like a four-year-old vlog. It was me and Heel Wife, Molly and Amy, and we were all at the county fair, and Tina was in the background of the video. And I thought that was cool. It's like, oh, wow, we were in the same place at the same time, right? But, but, but now it gets fucking crazier, you guys. A fan just sent me a video and goes, why is Tina hanging out with Heel Wife in this video? And I said, what? Hanging out with? And she's not really hanging out with her, but she is sitting by her. They are sitting together. And it's in Disney. And that doesn't make no sense to me because Tina told me she'd never been to Disney. Remember we went to Disney and it was a whole big thing. Hero, I'm the hero taking her to Disney finally. She was already at Disney. Guys, look at this video. Tell me I'm crazy, okay? This is five years ago. We're on vacation. There's a vlog and there's Tina right behind Barbara. I, I don't even know if they show it again, but you guys, you guys, I'm sorry, 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 I'm I wanted to ask you about something. What? I found this was very, to be very curious. What? This was a vid from like five years ago. Okay. Right? It's one of my old vids and there's my ex-wife and my daughters were here and we're in Disney's Animal Kingdom and we're on this ride. And wait, you see you're sitting behind ones. Barbara. And they look like they're heavy ones, but they're really not too heavy. They're actually quite light. They're maybe about 15 pounds each or it's so. It's fucking you! It's fucking you! Is that not you? Um. I thought you never went to Disney. I haven't been to Magic Kingdom. Remember, I have but family went, down there. You went to Animal Planet? Well, I thought it was Bush Gardens, but I was kind of drunk because it was my cousin's <clears throat> wedding. I'm but, not surprised if I was there. Okay. That was you. That was definitely you. <laughs> um, question. Question. Because you look super fucking guilty right now like you knew about this. Have you been stalking me and my family all this time? Ooh. Guys, I'm freaked out. Guys, I'm freaked out. And I say freaked out. I made this little hangout shit outside, so I can... <sighs> I've never been afraid of Tina. Everything's always been fine. But this just changed everything. Because she told me she was never at Animal Planet. She was clearly at Animal Planet. And now, she's sitting behind Barbara and she acted like... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think I just caught her being a straight up stalker. She's not even coming out to check on me. God. Here she is. Where are you? I'm in here. What are you doing in there? I didn't know what to do, man. That was really weird, and you're acting really weird all of a sudden. It was a coincidence. Why you didn't act like coincidence? You acted like, like. Busted. That was definitely me, but I'm just trying to tell you, I was down there for a wedding, and I I don't really remember much because I was really blasted drunk the whole time. My cousin got me so, to different parks. I remember we went like on a, a run, like we were going to one park or another park. I remember be, I remember starting the drink at Bush Gardens. <laughs> I'm not surprised that I ended up on the safari. In Disney. Yes, I don't even remember being there. 
You saw me wearing sunglasses. I was probably so drunk out of my mind. But that's so weird that you were sitting right behind my ex-wife when that was, I mean, not to say things were good, but I was with her and I was with my kids and we were in Disney on a family vacation. I didn't and even know you yet. I didn't know you either. You were just a random stranger in the background, but that's so creepy that you were there. But it was a coincidence, I swear. You, okay, that's that's the only thing. If it was coincidence, then then that's awesome. That's honestly way different than... Because people were starting to say, yo, Tina's not who you think she is. You know, I always get those weird messages. Mm -hmm. You know, and I always no-sell it because fuck them. But in... in when someone says, yo, Tina's been lying to you, I think she's been stalking you, she's in the background of this video, and she slid to you and said she's never been to Disney, and there you are at Disney, and you're busted because you're in my video, and then I ask you about it, and you're just like, ooh. Like, like oh, no. Like, I was there, but I wasn't, like, there. <laughs> I'm so fucking... I had to sit and process it for a second. Yeah, me too. Like, and then, and then, like, I'm sorry, your reaction freaked me the fuck out, man. Look, my 20s were very hazy, okay? <laughs> All right? No, no, that was five years ago, miss. You weren't in your 20s. Yes, I was. <laughs> oh, yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> so it was just a coincidence? I swear to you. It was totally a coincidence. All right. No, I believe you because... You don't ever lie to me, and you don't have a reason to lie to me. And if anything, it actually makes me kind of happy, because you want to know why? Why? You know what that means. What? You know what that means. What? You know what that means. That our energies were so drawn to each other <laughs> that we were always just winding up in the same places together, even if it was a thousand miles away. <laughs> That's what that means. Yeah. That we were just drawn to each yeah. other, Remember? and uh, we were meant to oh, be. I have chippy spatter all over me. And her little, her little crummy chest here. <laughs> Full of chip crumbs. <laughs> My popcorn chili powder. All right, so that's it. You were meant to be. Yay. Hey, not stalking. I'm not weird like that. I didn't think you would be. That's what I'm saying. Like, like it's not, not like anymore. I know you. Not <laughs> that'll, that'll be for another vlog. But I do have a history I must tell you about. Wait, wait, uh, of stalking? No. Of stalking? I wouldn't put it on. I wouldn't call it that. What? What do we call it then? <laughs> You'll have to see when I tell you more. Wait, wait, I, I was literally just about to put you over and say that here I am. I know her for two years, two and a half years, and you've never really done anything weird or crazy or whatever till today. That was my old self. All right, well, listen, my old self did some shitty shit too. I've changed my ways. I've grown up. I've apologized. I've taken responsibility. And I guess I will allow it if you've done the same. But let's not, let's not have any more of that. <laughs> no, what's in the past is in the past. Yeah. And for the people are pissed part of the program, guys, remember like two or three weeks ago, I said I can finally start building my toy room once I get these bullshit ass windows replaced. Guess what? They fucking canceled my installation. They said the what? The fucking windows that I ordered six months ago. At first, they only ordered six of them instead of eight. They forgot these two. Then, I, for, I don't know, I forget what the fucking reasons are. Well, who cares what the fucking reasons are? They fucked me over. Lowe's. L-O-W-E-S. And I tagged them on Twitter, and now I'm blowing them up in this video, and I say, fuck you, you fucked me on my windows. I hope people don't buy windows from you now. And guys, if you know anybody who wants to fucking sell me some nice ass windows that can put them in fast and isn't gonna make me wait two months to back order them just for them to be the wrong size, just for them to forget one, please, because this is bullshit. And I wanna make my fucking toy room, goddammit. It's a mess in here. It's just stacks of shit and I can't set anything up because the fucks from Lowe's won't come put my windows in. I can't set toys up in front of it if I'm just gonna have to move them when I need new fucking windows. I need new fucking windows. I don't want to do this shit. I'm a goddamn entertainer, not a fucking handyman. He's here. He's here. What's going on? What's I don't going know. On? There's a UPS truck here. And that's exciting because I just got figures already earlier that I unboxed. Look, we got Ray Ray with all the build a fuckers. And this is an exciting build a fucker. You want to know why? Because it's the first ever Doc Hendrix. Ooh. I know. You're like, who? <laughs> ooh, <laughs> that, was ooh, the, ooh. that was the who? If I don't know now, I'll know eventually. <laughs> Coming to our house? I uh, better be. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Maybe don't film. I got two 
things. Yay! I wonder what they are. This is going to be the greatest unboxing in history of our sport because I don't even know what I ordered. Oh, wait. I might not be able to open this on camera. This might be for the other platform, Tia. Oh, gosh. Wrong platform. Listen, don't film my spicy peppers. <laughs> what is this? I don't even know what this stuff is from. Is it for me or you? Oh, no. This is wrong platform things. Don't. Right, fine, fine, listen, fine. Here. Here, you know what we're gonna do on this platform? I have something. I was literally looking at this. Dinosaur ass. First of all, what is that? What Toys R Us doesn't exist anymore. The Toys R Us catalog. I mean, the Amazon Christmas catalog. They have a catalog? Yeah. I didn't know that. I want that one right there. It <gasps> says Amazon exclusive, so we don't have it. Chomp chompies. Chompies! There's no wrestling in this whole thing. No? There's barely any Transformers. What kind of toy magazine is that? It's the worst toy magazine in the history of our sport. Look, they got Star Wars. Oh, wait, wait. There's Batman and E-Man. There's the Transformers. A couple ones for five-year-olds. Do I look like I want to play with this preschool bullshit? No, where's the fucking collector grade stuff, bitch? No. All you have is this. Wait, there's a WWE truck. That doesn't go on this page. That's the WWE Wrecking Brawler that I have. With Tonka trucks. What? 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 You're so stupid, Tina. I'm going to open my Doc Hendricks. Because <laughs> you, I have to tell you who this is. He's all in pieces. I'm going to put his ass to get him. First, we have to remove his legs. If you don't know where I got these from... Go watch my toy channel. Discount code GRIN saves 10% at WrestlingFigures.com. So, babes, I was talking to my stupid brother, Dooflop, earlier. We had this whole thing. Did you see the thing I put on Twitter about him? I'm yeah, selling him. You're pimping him out. This is my new business. Damien Yeast. Oh, look, and he's got the pointy hands. It's so costed you a leg. So, guys, while I get this open, I put my brother on blast on Twitter, on Instagram, and TikTok, because I'm trying to get people to buy his ass for Thanksgiving. Oh, my God. <laughs> and it's Rent-A-Boyfriend. It's my new business, and um, I think it will uh, be a very, very important venture. And I get 20%. Duhop gets the rest. <laughs> Listen, he so needs the help. You're pimping him out. You are a pimp. You are Grim the Pimp. I am Pimp Daddy. Now, look at <laughs> the, the Rey Mysterio. Oh, okay. So on the other channel, I pointed out that to make the Doc Hendricks, the only thing the Rey Mysterio even comes with is extra hands to hold the microphone. There's the microphone. Fuck. So in this one, he's like doing the fucking Daniel Bryan. Yes. Yes. Or he's, uh, you know, wrong platforming. <laughs> but, <laughs> but I didn't know that I actually do need the Ray Ray. <clears throat> there it goes. <coughs> I'm still a little sick. I feel a lot better. Guys, I almost died the other night. What is that show we went to? Extreme Tools? Mm -hmm. I almost died. Mm. You were so hoarse by the end of it. Oh, it was awful. <sighs> These are so hard to do. <laughs> Wait, is this even the right hand? I think they got this all fucked up. Wait a minute. Yeah, this is this arm. Yeah. Wow. He's got a really long finger. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she said. That's what she said. There we go. Now we got his stupid arms on. There we go. Yeah, what's with the fingers? This is horrific. That's why they put the hands in the Rey Mysterio figure. Yeah. Because you because, probably don't want to enjoy those hands. Because you're like, <laughs> you're like, hey, you can get these hands. Why do they look so weird? Why does he look like Barney the human? <laughs> he does! Oh my god, Barney the human. Barney is a human who looks like a fucking dinosaur. <laughs> he looks really cringe. This is one of the worst figures they've ever made. He looks like Disco Stew, don't advertise. Who's he look like? Maybe Smart Mark Sterling? <laughs> <laughs> he looks like the guy from Memphis for Family, but blonde. <laughs> I'd like to have what she's having. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'd like to mash her potatoes. Yeah, that guy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'd like to file her cabinets. 
<laughs> he turned everything into an innuendo. Yeah, every anything. Yeah. Anything said. I'd like to Bella Herbree. It does, it looks like him, doesn't it? It does. It's the same face. Yeah, well, that, that was his character, like those 70s. Yeah. Yo, Bree's getting her Bree bellied right there. I really get your bell ringing. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Okay, ready? So you got... It's Bree Bella. He's like, you want to see what I can do with my disco fingers? <laughs> oh, they're going to be the wrong platform in a second. <laughs> oh, he's like, he's oh. like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. All right, I got to stop. Somebody stop me. <laughs> Guys, thanks for watching the vlog today. Please like this video, leave a comment, subscribe for more. Let me know in the comments below what was your favorite part. And do you think that my quarantine of the love of my life is telling me the truth? Of course I am. Or is she a stucker who's planned to, to have me alter her own this entire time? You really think I'm capable of that? Yeah. <laughs> I believe in you. <sighs> and I'm glad you did because I want to be yours. <laughs> the drugs are working. What are you doing? What? What are you doing? Oh, come watch me throw some eggs. Look, they're no good. Best by September 27th. Oh. And we haven't eaten them because I've been doing so good and losing weight. And now, we'll throw them at Donna's house. No, no, no. Why do you mean throw them at Donna's house? Well, no, I'm just kidding. Where are you going to put the pellet? I don't know. Wait there, I thought about this. No, don't throw them at that person. Oh, you know what you should do? We have spray paint. You can make circles, and then each one can be certain points. If anybody asks what's going on, that's my egg throwing palette. <laughs> Why am I like this? I don't know. I think you had a fever for like three days straight, and you were stuck in the house. We weren't able to do anything, and now all of a sudden you've got these random crazy ideas. The return of the king. You're practicing your old baseball moves. This is the World Series, Tina. It's the bottom of the ninth. If I strike him out, we win the World Series. If he hits a home run, we lose the World Series. Ball! Oh my god, that was so off. That was really bad. All right, listen. I'm still recovering, and I haven't thrown a baseball egg in a long time. Baseball egg? Right through the holes! Right through the slats! Ah! This one's already broke! <laughs> That's a juicer! And meanwhile... <laughs> and the wind just blew down the other one and broke Fuck it. you, wind! <laughs> what the hell? Fuck you, wind! It cracked this one too, didn't it? Yeah, it did! Ah! Oh, Oh, gussing everywhere now. Oh my gosh. Yeah! Well, there you go. Yeah! <laughs> Did you like that egg afternoon? Oh, I think you need a new hobby. <laughs>